Hello, everyone. Um, as you all know, being uh, faculty at the community college and working with a wide variety of students um, and using technology in your classrooms, you find yourselves uh, providing technical support in a lot of instances, especially when using college-owned equipment or, or um, other applications uh, supported by the college. Uh, and so one of the things I wanted to kind of focus on in addition to, you know, making uh, activities more device and operating system agnostic is, is to kind of um, get an idea of where you can find support for, for various applications. So if students are using uh, their own applications that they've purchased uh, or they're using maybe a recommended cross-platform application, maybe something you found uh, in an earlier lesson. Um, you know, helping students finding where they can get support uh, when needed. And so, um, you know, basically developers, they provide all kinds of support mechanisms for the applications they create because they, they want people to be successful with their applications. So you can take away that, that burden um, off your shoulders and kind of move it towards the developers themselves, especially if, you know, if students are choosing their own applications to use uh, to, to create assignments for you. And so in the, the next video, I'll kind of showcase, um, you know, where, where typically you can find support resources for various applications. Um, and, and part of this, uh, part of, of the document, the need for documentation in a Google spreadsheet is that um, we'll have a kind of a list of, of resources for that you can use in your classrooms. And this one being support resources for specific applications. Um, but, but keep in mind that, uh, like I said, developers are really interested in, in people being successful with their applications. So they do uh, put quite a bit of effort into providing support. And that support um, sometimes is, you know, via phone, but mostly it's via email or Twitter or, you know, some kind of forum on their website, something like that. Um, but uh, we'll, in the next video, we'll kind of show you some examples and then you'll look for some uh, support resources uh, for some of the applications you've chosen. All right, thanks.